You're watching 13 on your side. The holidays are a wonderful time of year to celebrate family and friends, and that often means gifts, but many kids don't often have the same opportunities. And that's where Operation Good Cheer comes in. Laura Mitchell from Samaritas is here to explain how it all works. So what is Operation Good Cheer? Well, Operation Good Cheer is a colossal volunteer effort to get Christmas gifts to 6,000 children across Michigan who are living in foster care or in residential treatment facilities. And so why is it difficult for children in these situations to have the same opportunities as other kids? Well, the kids who are living in foster care, they're not living with their own families. It's a very difficult time of year, um, not because of anything that the kids have done, um, but it's it's just a time where uh, Samaritas and volunteers want to really reach out to the children and really provide a phenomenal Christmas with lots of gifts under the tree. That's fantastic. And all the gifts are sitting at an airport right now. So how many yes. gifts did you guys collect and what happens from here? So statewide, there are over 20,000 gifts that have been collected, um, provided by donors. Um, or companies across the state. <clears throat> they are all at the airport in Pontiac and this morning, today is the big Operation Good Cheer Day. Um, this morning, 300 volunteer pilots will, will get the gifts to all the local airports um, where agencies are participating. And so Samaritas, we are participating statewide, providing gifts to over 700 of our children um, and locally that is 200 children will receive gifts. So we'll be at the airport in Grand Rapids um, in about an hour and we'll be waiting for the planes to arrive. The gifts come wrapped. Um, the pilots often wear um, Christmas hats, dress as Santa. It's just a very, very fun time. That's fantastic. Yes. Thank you so much for joining us this morning since you're yes. headed to the airport so yes. soon. And so then you meet them at the airport and then you have to transport all of those presents. Yes. So then what does that process look like? So locally we also have, um, we have our team of staff. Some of their children also come to participate and help in the effort. We also um, have a great partnership with the Teamster Horseman Motorcycle Association and Spartan Nash who has donated a semi. So the semi will be at the airport. We fill it up with the gifts, get them back to our office, and then the um, Teamster Horseman Motorcycle Association as well as staff and volunteers help to unload the truck, get the gifts organized um, for foster families to then come in this week um, and on Tuesday during an open house to gather the gifts for the kids that are living with them. Fantastic. Yes. So many different people in the community coming yes. together for yes. this. I really appreciate you joining us this morning. Yes. If you'd like to learn more, we have all of the details on our website, 13onyourside.com.